What's up everybody? Tiffany Outdoors here. Today I'm going to be doing some Dutch oven cooking, so stay tuned. So the first thing I need to do is get a fire started. I'm going to be using some charcoal. got my fire going really good now so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my Dutch oven and set it right in there on the fire let the pan get nice and hot let it get good and hot and then I'm going to add some onions and some salt pepper and garlic So I got one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of garlic, and a quarter of a teaspoon of black pepper in here. Oh yeah, they're already starting to sizzle. I got a little bit of vegetable oil in here too. I want those onions to get nice and soft and sauteed. Then we'll add our other ingredients. Next I'm going to add four cups of water and two, two bouillon cubes. Now if you want to, you don't have to do this, you can just use chicken broth. But I have bouillon cubes, so that's what I'm going to use. I want to crumble them up to make sure that they dissolve fully. Stir that up. Give that bouillon cube time to dissolve. While that's heating up, I'm going to put my lid on it, trap that heat in. Next thing I'm going to do is add my chicken or turkey. This is leftover turkey from Thanksgiving. And if you don't have any on hand, you can always go to Walmart and get one of their rotisserie chickens. The next thing I'm going to add is a condensed can of cream of chicken soup. And give that a good stir. Get it mixed in. This right here is going to thicken it up. Okay, this last step that I'm going to do is I'm going to use a can of biscuits and what I did was I just opened them up and quartered them and I'm going to take my Dutch oven and move it over here to the cooking platform and these here are going to be so good when they turn into the dumplings I want to drop them in individually that way they're not sticking together quite so bad and then Give that a quick stir. Mix it in and then I'm going to move it to the platform and I'm going to put coals on the top and also on the bottom.
That's going to cook those biscuits. Oh man, my charcoal's not all the way good. It'll keep smoldering and cooking. I'll get some of these that are turned white. I got a few white ones in the fire that I'm going to set on top here. I want those biscuits to cook. Now well, it's been right at about 10 minutes, but that thing is sizzling. I'm going to open it up and check it. I don't want my stuff to burn. Oh yeah, what, what? Oh yes, it this is actually boiling, and the dumplings are almost done. Stir this up from the bottom, make sure nothing's sticking, and it isn't. And the dumplings are just about, just about done. I'm pull one out and give it a taste test. this real quick. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. That's perfect. Oh, wow. That's so good. Mmm. I thought I was going to have to add more seasoning in there. But it's, it's really good. I don't need to add anything. It's perfect just the way it is. I'm going to let it go for a couple more minutes and then I'm going to dump these coals back into the burn pit here. Alright guys, this is why I built this platform by my burn pit. So when I'm done with my coals, I can just push them back into the pit. Let them finish burning out there. I hope you all enjoyed today's episode. I'm gonna go inside and eat. It's quite chilly out here right now. So this nice, warm, hot bowl of turkey and dumplings is gonna be perfect. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And you can also follow me on Twitter and Instagram. And I will see you guys later. Bye.